I, I felt like I, I was looking pretty sharp today, and then like everybody has been complimenting me. Dude, so I mean, like, you're dude. wearing a suit and tie. I'm just wearing what I usually wear, which just I mean, you look happens good. to be pretty nice. Yeah. I mean, you always dress pretty nice. Yeah, dressing nice is like that's how you. It's like drinking good water. That's what it's like. You play better when you dress nice. Right. You feel nice. You feel confident. You know what I mean? Good things happen when you dress nice. God, I. I'm gonna try to dress you nice this year. My so we have, <laughs> we have Brandy Venus Falco and then We're Rob live? is Holly Pop. We're live, right? Uh, yeah, we're live. This is it. I'm kidding, I didn't realize. <laughs> but, um... Oh my god, wow, who uses Fox? That's... Jump is the Pop. I think I've ever seen Slug play on stage. Slug is from the 717 region. He is pretty damn good. And also pretty chill. Yeah, like I've, there's, there's like two different schools of vibes. Now ultimately they meet in the middle, but there's like hyper aggro. Yeah, yeah. There's a, there's like the you know team 20xx, right? Like I haven't seen like a, any kind of shine from him at all yet. But I do see that he's carefully choosing his spots. And you know what's so interesting? Fox is such a good player or a good character, excuse me, that he can have like high success whether you're like really technical or not. That's very true. I mean. He does oh, have some shine. dumb moves, I will say that. Like, I think that the knockback on up smash is really dumb. Yeah. And, like, moves like that. Yeah, we've got the moves Literally, like, the more I watch, the more I'd rather watch Fox than like, some other characters. Ices are fun to watch because they're just trolly as hell. Falco is fun to watch. Pump I like to watch the best. I always say, like, Ice Club moves are fun to watch for me. Honestly, until, like,. Until they grab somebody. Unless they do the crazy decent thing. Oh, dude. That's crazy what it's like. I'm just saying, too, like I'm just like, too good. You can get out of my face. That's in, like the in best. The world. Like, you see, Pete, like, uh, Wobbles did like this crazy decent combo, too. Wobbles, Wobbles is so good. Cool. Yeah, those things are always hype. But the thing I'm talking about, I think it's like, like it's pretty just infamous like, at this point. The infamous Wobble. Like, um. Uh, it's. Too that and uh, Evo when he was like Wobble. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, it's not. It's not like I. Have no, that wasn't Wobble. That wasn't Wobble and Hugs twice. That was just him having skill. Yeah, he he, he kind of like just hugs threw it away. Pretty he did. much. Dude, I love Judas. You know, watching this funny. <laughs> but Judas a, a huge troll. You know. What I mean? know. I love it. He's I awesome. shouldn't, but I love it. Uh, yeah, damn, damn the best. But um, but the the reason why a lot of people don't like wobbling is because it, it, it essentially becomes a one player game. You know what yeah, I mean? yeah, I can see that. There's a lot of the setups that, that really smart ice climbers use are extremely like mind blowing. Sometimes you're like, oh my god. And then when yeah. they start wobbling, you're like, all right, I'm good. Yeah, it's like it's like the 30 setup. more seconds. It's like um, I'm trying to think. It almost reminds me like of like Professor Pro, like what he used to do. It's like something really hype into something that's just like oh. That happened. Like watching a really good match, and then it's just like they lose because of an SD. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's not quite I mean, on par with an SD, well, but it's not I know what you mean. Bad, it's the same like, kind of feeling. I can't think of a good analogy. I get what you mean. Like it, it's it's something that leaves like wow, how did you get by so many episodes? But there, it leaves sort of like a weird taste in, in, in the part of the mouth. That, and they're just like that's uh, the better one. Yeah. It's like, and wow, this is looking. Weird. Ultra Grim all of a sudden for the green team. Yeah, really. So well. I don't know what happened. That's it, I mean. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. See, Dude, he I mean. didn't even let Brandon break it out. Oh, okay. A little miniature pop off, too. I don't know why, but I have the strangest feeling that, like, time isn't on. No, it is. Okay. I'm just crazy. It's been on so far, so let's yeah. turn it off. Yeah, okay. I'm just crazy, then. Oh. oh, okay. So it's switching switching to Mark. I think this can be a good pick. Uh, I know how Brandy likes to play. He'll play the platform. Definitely. And Mark uh, on Yoshi's is all about the platform. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Up being like, yeah. Uh, I think. Yeah, I mean, he's definitely like grabbing the box up smash too. Oh man, see that's the, that's the reason why you pick this dude. Yeah, I don't, right there when he, he up threw Falco, I feel like we should have like back thrown him into up smash the box. That would have been so much. That would have been yeah. like amazing. Yeah, I don't 
I don't, do, I don't really like. Yeah, obviously, I don't under anymore. But when I did play doubles, I used to always be like a uh, part of a Mark Fox team, so I knew a little bit about how it should work. And man, these tippers are taking Brock. Really? Ow! Hey, tippers do that. Nice shot spike from Slug. Yeah, he's just swinging. Oh, and <laughs> Nana's Nana gets saved by Randall. Dude, Randall doesn't want to save any like humans today. He's just like, you're hurting Nana. And that's gonna be a wobble. Will. I don't think he's gonna. Oh, nice interruption. Interesting though. Dude. Where's his Brandon beat actually? Wait, what am I saying? Brock got him out of it. I thought that Brandon was in there. Brock's That's right. I don't know what I'm it's doing. It's too early, man. We're all we're all just picking up. It's cool. I probably. I mean, it's not early. I mean, I woke up at least. Oh, maybe that's it. I just need a little uh, block day or something. I don't know. Double man. shot of uh, espresso. Nah, 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 nah. I don't drink. Coffee. Okay, I don't drink coffee either. I know about it because you know, Brooks one of my best friends. He's a white chick, you know. Yeah. Charles. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we should edit that out. But, uh. <laughs> dude. I know all about the Starbucks specials. And yeah, all that, dude. You know. I can't drink all of you. It just tastes like bad. It tastes like liquefied garbage. Thank you. Sugar added in. And we'll just drink, food. like, hot tea. I love tea, dude. I'm a big. Oh, man. My God. Okay, Switch never mind. Is... Randall does feel like being friendly, but only to people who are wearing green and pink so far. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That actually could have been really bad for Brock. It's like, he grabbed the legend, and then Randall was like, yeah, you're not grabbing legend anymore. Uh, oh man, now, you know what? That might have been worth the trade. Yeah. Because they still have three stocks to one. Oh my god, I thought they were two stocks. He should have actually up aired right there. Right, now we get to see. Up stock. Yeah. Dude, when it's like Slug and Shum on one person, it's that was like really playing good. tennis. That was a really impressive turnaround. I'm really impressed. I'm actually really impressed by what I just saw. By what? Oh, by what you just by saw. By what I just saw, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That was, like, Dude, after, they the good. way they lost that last game, it could have been, like, easily very demoralizing, but they... They kept their heads together and discussed what happened. Dude, Slug and Chum have great teamwork. They're brothers. They play all the time. It's it's basically like two brothers from Rick and Morty on a team. <laughs> but I've missed Rick and Morty so much. I know, I need one season. So. Probably not gonna get it to like 28. It's kind of upsetting, but anyway, uh, so game three, uh, it is best of three, so. Yeah. I almost feel like, um... As for this pick, I can see the reason. Since, like, a Martha will just send them so far that they can't exactly, like, recover. What I think Marth should do, in this case, they're gonna have to treat, especially a single Ice Climber, like a floaty. Like, if the Marth hits him away and he doesn't die, they have to use his time to, uh, to, to just be one to Demolish Falco. Falco. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you, you don't Ooh, that's kill. another thing. I didn't even think of that. I just thought about it from, like, a recovery standpoint. Oh, wow. Well, I mean, okay, that works. Right now, Green Team with a slight lead. I mean, it's all up to the mark, right? He's got to kind of tank. Um, I and a lot of other people. Oh man, shield transfer. I know, taking out his own partner right there. I'm yeah, one of those people that thinks nuts. like, obviously, Mark is a better single character than he is a double character. I don't think anybody disagrees. But I think it's right, been now wow, we that Hipper. I think it's been largely exaggerated how bad Mark is in doubles. Uh, obviously, uh, he, again, he's a better one-on-one -on -one character than he is in Oh, teams. yeah, definitely. You could definitely pick a, a better team's character. But I can see, like, the benefit of having a good mark on the team. Like, you have that super long grab range, and you have, like, the nice back throw, so if you're paired up with, like, a box... And I, I know from experience just... that, uh, Frog can struggle against Mark. Uh, in fact, like, one of the last tournaments I entered, I, I beat Frog. Uh, he's gotten much better since then, but, like, I, I do remember, like, the difference in how... Dude, it's nice. It's like it's a sad, sad world. Yeah. Honestly, I think if wobbling wasn't legal, that matchup would be near unwinnable price timer. Dude, yeah. Even with wobbling legal, like you, it's still a hard match. You play smart. Just has so much range. And you, yeah, if you play smart, and you play fair. Like you can throw out fairs all day. You can just down. Oh man, That's what an unfortunate turnaround right there for the green team. It's like exactly even stocks, even like percentages. Yeah. 
Now the boost is slightly. Ollie's got to play the stock take. He's trying to survive. Oh god. All right, yeah. Now it's back to basics. I love how Brandon's tagging Olipop. Olipop like moves to uh, or Olipop's like in Florida right now or something like that. Yeah. I don't know the details. Hopefully we'll see him soon. Huh? What do you say? Olipop. Like uh, that's Brandon's tag right now because it's oh. like one of his friends. He like moved to Florida or something like that for a small period of time. Oh. Uh, oh. As long as you're not on the run from like the cops. No, no, no. no. <laughs> you never know. I know. Olipop's. Oh man. Oh, yeah. And, uh, it's all up. Marth's not the greatest 2v1 character, uh, so he's really gonna have to... Dude, we can see some stupid things. Every... There's always... There's almost always been, like, a, some weird, amazing 2v1 comeback. Oh, and Ollie does the not exact work. stupid thing you should not do. There it is. But... All he has to do... Alright, all right. now he's just playing the same. Good set. Unfortunately for them, uh, I believe it was Chum, who uh, was the fox. Slug is, uh, Slug is the fox. Or Slug, I mean, uh, who, who FD'd. And then he uh, got, like, killed by the side B, which would have been an edge guard. Yeah, that's uh, always unfortunate when it happens. Yeah. 